Shall we give it a go? Kolla ju. Give it a try. Sound level is fabulous. <laughs> So did you have any takeaways, any learnings? It sure sounded like it. Um, I mean, we're, we're, we're finishing off uh, day one really now. Uh, so there's a also a full day tomorrow. And we'll do some sneak peeks uh, about that uh, in just a little bit. But how do you really sum up uh, today? I've, I've, I've had a number of uh, interesting takeaways myself. Uh, I think uh, one of the biggest one was probably from Joss. Uh, I mean, this is just a 50 plus problem. So uh, eventually people will die out and then all this will be <laughs> sort of sorted. Uh, th that's one takeaway. Uh, then the panel had some, some interesting uh, things to, to pass along. Uh, be radical was obviously one. And then one thing that is uh, sometimes boring to hear, but uh, quite effective, it's start from the inside and start small. So thank you very much, Maria, for passing that on. I mean, we need to start somewhere. And I think this day is, is uh, one of the components for that. Uh, also, uh, we talked a lot about self-leadership uh, in the panel, uh, at least. And we've, we've uh, gotten back to it several times. So the fact that it, this is not typically a, a, a sort of a management problem to tackle. This is, a, this is a, a, an individual uh, movement that we need to be able to tackle as individuals. Uh, so a lot of self-leadership that was... That was uh, some and then uh, a number of, of takeaways from from Mary's uh, uh, talk, but uh, I think I'll, I'll just save myself uh, a few more. But Pia Mia. Yes, uh, the, my biggest takeaway when I heard the panel discussion was that change is happening faster than I actually thought, and uh, it feels like now it's really close, something great is going to happen and it fills me with a feeling of excitement. So I'm very happy about that. And that just struck me, it's happening now. Now we are very soon, something's gonna change very much, uh, I feel. And when I listened to jo Joss, uh, it struck me also that it's not about what we should do uh, or how do we start or what steps do we take or what tools do we need? It's much more about what should we stop doing, actually. It's just to stop doing the things that doesn't create engagement. And then, as James Priest said, it will unfold. People will uh, let themselves be their whole selves. And, and change will unfold by itself without we having to interfere with it. Um, I also was impressed by, by James and uh, with this deep insight that he talks about and uh, the belief in people that we really are so capable, all of us. The seagull Mel Mary was fantastic, fabulous metaphor. I'm going to take that with me and steal that slide for my future talks. Um, and Mary also made us, I don't know if you noticed, but on the website there is a conference code of conduct or similar, I don't know how you say it in English, but uh, it says that no harassment is accepted because you're different on the site. I never thought that, oh, but we don't need that in Sweden. But obviously we may need that still. Uh, many fantastic discussions and I'm sure you were part of many of them as well. So that's my takeaway for today. Awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'll just tie into to some of what you said. Uh, Mary's, uh, Mary's whole mission about creating organizations where there's space to be awesome, I think that's really a sort of a, um, an overall takeaway on what we should focus on and, and the components to drive that. And, and um, I've heard a number of other fast-growing companies that are organizing in different ways. And this whole notion of getting out of their way, get sort of hire the best people and then make sure you do everything you possibly can or just get the fuck out of their way. There we go. Uh, we can swear in, in, in Sweden too. <laughs> um, all right, so, so that's a few, few um, in English. Yes, of course, <laughs> we wouldn't do it in Swedish. Uh, <laughs> right, so this, this is what... Sure, we'll, we'll do that during the, the, the mingle. 
Um, it's also been a lot of things happening uh, on Twitter. How many have been tweeting? There we go, yeah, so quite a few. Uh, so we thought we'll see what's, what's been trending on Twitter. Uh, so we've asked uh, Tobi Jullenbring to, to join us. He's being mic'd up right now. It's, uh, yeah, tech problems. Tech problems, my techie. Of course we have tech problems. So Twitter. There we go, yes, please. Uh, so we've been tweeting the shit out of this conference. So, and it has been resonating around the world, actually. So we have had interactions from Nova Scotia, San Diego, uh, Glasgow, a really crazy town called Gothenburg, and a really exotic <laughs> place called Rebru. There we go. Uh, and what sort of, what has the buzz been about? So we're agile people. And the thing that has been resonating is people. That's the main takeaway. People being brilliant. And perhaps we should actually, yes, change the conference to awesome people. Because that's what it has been all about. People being themselves and becoming the best they can be. So that's awesome. How, what's the sort of volume of tweets? Have we sort of, you know, what's Well, the... uh, we trended enough that we attracted spam bots. There we go, okay. So that's awesome. We also managed to get the attention of one of the biggest conferences in Sweden. They wanted to hi hijack our hashtag to sell their conference. So that must be <laughs> something. Uh, during your session, we actually managed to have over 100 interactions, uh, which is approximately the Twitter volume we had over a complete uh, first uh, half day at a conference four times the size of this. So the message has been resonating to a lot of people. Perfect. And, and if you're curious to see the feed, just go into Twitter uh, and, and it's the hashtag Agile People, uh, if you haven't noticed. Uh, so there you'll have it. All the, the All the things. Yes. Or at least uh, many of the things. Yes. Okay. So there are things that exist, but not there. I, I, I think there's things people picked up from the conference that they didn't tweet, which makes me sad. I worked so hard sad. for you guys and Someone then you didn't add to it. Their phones. <laughs> okay. Thanks a lot, Tobe, and uh, you'll stick around. So if you're really curious to dig deep into this, you're, you're most welcome to do that. Um, all right, so uh, Pia Mia, what happens tomorrow? You, you, you get the mic back, actually. <clears throat> because this is not the end. Um, and, and for those of you that are still not signed up for tomorrow, but interested in, in attending tomorrow, there are a number of workshops, so I, I believe there's still room uh, to yes, attend. Yes, there is we'll some space soon. for tomorrow. So there are lists in the reception. You can sign up for one of the workshops. And uh, you get half price okay. today. There you go. <laughs> uh, uh, we have some um, workshops, and uh, one of them is uh, Mary holding about brilliant teams. Um, we don't have time to bring up the people today, but we'll do that tomorrow so that everybody can give a quick talk about their workshop tomorrow morning. Um, there is also uh, just the block, humanity, humanity over bureaucracy. Yes. <laughs> and then there is management trio, which I am running. And then there is sociocracy trio that James Priest is running. So we have four different tracks. We will start in here uh, with a small uh, startup for the day. And we will also finalize the day in here to summarize uh, our thoughts and, and discussions that we have had in the different tracks. So that's uh, about what will happen tomorrow. OK, perfect. Uh, well, in that case, I think it's, uh, here, yeah, here's some details. <laughs> <Yeah>. um, <laughs> I think it's, uh, it's actually uh, detail where the, what's the word? Uh, yeah, it's available elsewhere as well. And for those of you who aren't coming tomorrow, sadly, uh, I hope to see you in, in uh, one of our meetups uh, at, uh, in the Agile People Network. Uh, we have, as I said, a meetup group, meetup.com slash agile hyphen people. And it's actually only available uh, in the meetup if you are in Stockholm. Otherwise, it will feel where you are in the world and it will only show the meetups in the area. So you need to say that you are in Stockholm if you are somewhere else. And then you will find the meetup group because it's based in Stockholm. 
So you're very, very welcome to continue discussion in our network. And um, yeah, I think it's time for Agile Ale. I uh, think so, isn't it? But it's time before for a beer. Before that, uh, I'd like us to give a, a super big hand for all the speakers, speed speakers, uh, and for the Agile People crew, all deserving a big, a big hand. Thank you.